I regret to inform you that the things that might have gone worse since the last time, and uh, and uh, still, it's still bad, still bad. It's a. Uh, The uh, 83 of a uh, wave two, wave two of uh, coronavirus in Canada, and uh, it is the sixth day in a row with uh, two two thousand over two thousand cases, and the forty fifth day with uh, over thousand cases in a row. Just as a reminder, Hamilton will enter the gray zone on Monday, December 21st due to high cases. Specific rules are given. Four hundred and eighty six uh cases are uh, from Toronto. For for sixty eight is from Peel region. That's pretty close enough. Three twenty six is from York region, one fifty one is from Winter Essex uh, region, and one twenty one twenty eight is from Niagara region. So Niagara has a uh, Ended up uh, with a high on the list with uh, the highest uh, number of cases uh, within the province, and those who those who are like going to planning on going to Niagara for like a day, uh, yeah. Let's see. The problem with that is, uh, yeah. The number of cases, uh, which is uh, getting closer to the number of cases than Win Windsor Exeter region, uh, yeah, things can get worse. Uh, Twenty-five uh, new deaths were reported. The that not uh, reported given the number of uh, the the average uh, number uh, on cases uh, no uh, under hundred. It's strange. So yeah. Just a reminder uh, the red zone rules uh, are uh, Still standardized, uh, because that's the one that, that's a sort of change. The uh, London Middlesex region still have it, same for Muskoka region, Wellington Dufferin Gulf region, Waterloo region, and Halton region have to follow these. And only Hamilton today. It's the last day for the red zone rules. Because tomorrow Hamilton's going to get bumped up to the gray zone. So, you know, Waterloo region uh, has its own rules. Simco Muskoka has its own rules, you know. It's not different than the standard uh, red zone rules. Waterloo region, the uh, only event spaces in the uh, only allow 10 people in at a time, the rest is all closed.
Some come with Skulka. Five people indoors and 25 outdoors for like uh, gatherings of any kind. And restaurants and barns, uh, gyms and fitness centers. 10 people inside, maximum. And uh, fitness classes, uh, 10 people indoors, 25 uh, outdoors. Uh, the Toronto Rodriguez. Don't uh, raise on rules, aka lockdown. Don't the rules are pretty standardized. A whole bunch of stuff is closed. But uh, if I've looked at the rules and uh, the York region of rules and uh, Hamilton of rules are very similar, except for some differences. So, uh, I want to read uh, the York Region rules uh, first. Indoor league uh, team, uh, individual team sports aren't allowed except for high performance athletes in professional leagues. Gatherings of any kind are not allowed except people from the same household. So, drive in cinemas are open. Rehearsals and performances are allowed without spectators. Household services are allowed, so, like, that's like, like nannies, babysitters, like, you know, that kind of, that kind of stuff. No, health services are open like dentists and doctors and like you know hospitals post-secondary classes are open to medical training and uh, classes or in the trades only classes are open to and uh supermarkets grocery stores convenience stores big box stores hardware stores and pharmacies are open to 50 people at a time Real estate and car dealerships and indoor garden centers are open on appointment only. Sports and recreation centers are open for things like childcare. Open uh, the garden centers are allowed to open and uh, do curbside pickup. And can and uh, curbside pickup is uh, allowed for cannabis stores, libraries, shops at uh, retail stores, and shops at malls. That which are the uh, specific parking uh, spots now. School and child care centers are open unless mentioned. So Hamilton somewhat different. Film and tele tele television uh, production is not allowed. Individual team sports that aren't allowed except for high performance athletes and professional leagues. Gatherings and of course the uh, gatherings of any kind are not allowed. Now, this, the rest is very uh, similar to the other uh, the York region uh, special special rules. Drive-in cinemas, that's the same. Rehearsal and performances allowed without spectators. That's the same, so... Uh, although uh, the like, media production, like, uh, you know, like news... Uh, news production that though that is allowed as long as they don't have a live audience in uh, Hamilton so that's the special rules and the household services and health health services and allowed post-secondary that is also standardized uh, so only the uh, medical training or uh, the trades are open to for uh, in uh, in class. Uh. Um, some things are sort of different. Uh, so, uh, supermarkets, uh, grocery stores, uh, convenience stores, and big box stores, hardware stores, and pharmacies are open to fifty people at a time. Retail and car dealerships are open on appointment only. Sports and recreation facilities are open things like child care. Curbside pickup is available for cannabis stores, libraries, and retail stores. That's sort of what's uh, different. Uh, so re retail stores are not to be opened uh, unlike uh, the York region. Uh. 
and of course uh, you know, shops at malls. Uh, In the York region, the big one is uh, Vaughn Mills. Uh, so anyone uh, shopping at that place, yeah, curbside pickup is available there. So, and hospitalizations today is uh, 875 people are hospitalized right now. Lower than last time. 261 is in uh, ICU. One hundred and fifty-six uh, in ICU on a ventilator. Long-term care home uh, deaths, uh, 2,502 uh, deaths right now. And the uh, number of outbreaks right now is uh, 154. Sad to hear that. So again, rural regions uh, ask uh, gray zone and red zone uh, region uh, people that uh, not uh, come over. And food banks, uh, of course, uh, if you can uh, donate to your like uh, local uh, food bank uh, near you. I'm just going to read out the coronavirus rankings right now. They've gone worse. Quebec, Ontario, Alberta, and uh, BC in the top four. Quebec is now at uh, 174,839. Ontario, 157,749. Alberta, 88,933. BC, 45,400. Manitoba, 22,630. Saskatchewan, 13,329. Nova Scotia, 1,445. New Brunswick, 578. Newfoundland and Labrador, 380. Nunavut, 259. PEI, 90. Yukon Territories, 59. Most of the territory is at 24. So if you want a coronavirus that uh, out by early 21, you better start contributing. You know, 
and uh, continue like following our uh, coronavirus uh, safety rules and uh, regulations. Uh, you know, don't have any uh, large gatherings with anyone. This Christmas, don't uh, have any large gatherings uh, with uh, others uh, that do not live in your household. Uh, if you have a small number of those, you can invite at least one household over and that is it. Use social media to talk with others and only go on essential travel. Keep their health their first priority. Stay out of areas where coronavirus gets can be high and avoid going to places if you're from a high case area. Great the red zone. And check which college zone your region is in. And uh, just be careful right now because uh, peop people like who, who are like flying over from the uh, yeah, United States uh, of America or uh, the, or the yeah, or uh, UK uh, coronavirus cases are like super high over over there in both places. Uh, so uh, anyone flying over from there to uh, here, yeah, avoid contact. Stay safe, folks. Remember, changes are like a uh, happening starting tomorrow morning, twelve o one a.m. for Hamilton. Let's try, at least uh, pray that that these uh. Coronavirus cases that uh, they don't uh, exceed uh, 2,500 or yeah, let no hope they literally go down like people. But to do that, people really need to start like con like contributing and yeah, lower them cases, follow them rules. Audi.